So today we got something very special for you guys. So we've opened up MCIs on the channel before. We've all tried them, as I'm sure most of you have. But today we have a classic Vietnam War item that uh, we managed to get sealed. So, uh, some, most of you guys already know about this, whether from documentaries. Family, documentaries, family members that have served in Vietnam. It's something, you know, that would, like, brighten up a soldier's day. You know, like, like getting a four, like getting a pack of sea rat cigs when you get a sea rat, you know, mm -hmm. or a 33. An extra cracker in your B unit. <laughs> extra cracker in your B unit. So, we're pretty, pretty honored to have something, you know, that really made some of these guys' days. So this is sealed from uh, 1968, right? Oh, uh, wait, let me see. Okay. Uh, it's a DSA-100-100, uh, nothing, so it's 66. Okay, there's no... It's 66. It's 66, there's no that. It's just a DSA-100. Anyways, so we're um, <laughs> pretty pumped about this, and I can't believe we're going to try it. They're, they're pretty rare. I think they were only made from 65 to 68. Yeah, there was some type of weird fucking... After 68, they came out with a different pair, the second pattern. Yeah, the second pattern, which is just a different name and stuff. It's not as classic. Yeah. Uh, I think Cole, want to put in the commercial for it right now? Yep, I'll put in the commercial right, right now. Commercial going now. Al Pacino's Booty Sweat. Popping ass open. Booty Sweat and Buster Nut Bars. Available at concessions now. So, uh, as you guys seen, this is for Booty Sweat. It was a pretty popular drink down in Vietnam. I mean, it kind of came from Da Nang and worked its way yeah. around. Yeah, a lot of the it. shipments came from Da Nang. A lot of the shipments came from Da Nang. And, uh, it was so popular that many of the PX employees would hoard them there. So all the guys would have to actually go to Da Nang to get it. Yeah, you'd find that a lot of black markets in Nang or Saigon or something like that. I mean, you see them all over the place. I mean, even look at footage. You can look at the background. You can see Mama Son, Papa Son, passing, hey, GI, booty sweat, you know? Yeah. Mm -hmm. You see like, all the uh, time. They'll be in, like, uh, a storefront, you know? Yeah, Mixed storefront. Mixed in with American, uh, Americana, like Cokes and... Uh, the Cokes or Marbreds. It's the random stolen yeah. shit from PXs. So, uh... Um, black market. The black market has... Yep. Yeah, pretty much we're just... Okay. Yeah, something for the light. So, uh... New England boys. We have a nickname. We should have a nickname for three of us. The 51 Boot Gang. And fi no, it fits. Uh, think of something better. Um, dumbass. What, like New England? New England. New England. Uh, Vietnam Airsoft. Two normals and an Asian. No, <laughs> I go by Flower Boy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Golly, sure am I lucky. Yeah. So, are you boys ready to make history? It yep. opens a sealed can of booty sweat. Pop an ass open. Mm -hmm. Let's do it. Let's get to it. You know? This is more iconic than a sea ration. This, yeah. this is like opening up a case this of 33. This is uh, one thing MRE Steve does not open. That's right. Let's hear this hiss, boys. All right, let's do it on three. Here, give me your hands, boys. Everyone hold the can of booty sweat as we open. No, nope, not that thing. Everyone put your hand on it. One, two, three. Ooh. 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 Hear that hiss? <laughs> nice hiss. Nice hiss. Wow. Because it's sort of lemony. I'm gonna walk. It, um... It's like this lemony, like... I know what that smell is. I just can't put my... Like, like more of a modern energy drink. Like, Maybe like, like a lemon... Jolly Rancher that's been left in a desert for nine months. Yeah, like, like if Red Bull made a lemon Jolly Rancher for five months. What's so, up? Uh, so uh, it's more like a lemony discharge. Just this overpowering scent that smells good, but yet kind of... Uh. Look at that. Look at that. Here we go. Here's the uh, nutrition facts. Bar the, bar the barcode this, this isn't is actually, there. No, no, no. This is the, actually the first implementation of a barcode. Yeah. 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 That, that was actually like it's, a, it's common belief that barcodes came out. Special in forces, special forces. It was a way to because uh, it was in so much popular demand. They needed to come up with a way to uh, yeah track it. Yeah. So actually, for most things, barcodes are not period correct. But for this, this is period correct because how popular intensity it was, and also this was a very controversial thing at the time, which Cole did show 
was a girl, in fact, popping her ass open. So you can see the silhouette of a woman. Wait, is is that anything there? Yeah, you can see the silhouette of a oh. woman pa popping her ass open. So, um... So is there any other like, kind of quotes used by this? I mean, let's see. Pop an ass open. I mean... I'm gonna get another whiff. Another whiff of that? This is history right now. So, in the making. Uh, yeah, very this is our official challenge, the Steve MRE 1989. Uh, watch out, <laughs> you guys got some competition now, okay? Because I highly doubt you're gonna get your hands on this. I mean, yeah. you get your hands on whatever survival rations you want, but this. Basically, every single one of them was uh, drunk by everyone in country. This and was specifically issued to paratroopers. They were some guys, guys in World, the paratroopers in World War One. We're like, hey, you know what? We need a certain kind of energy drink. Yeah, we tried meth a few times, but this... This was actually part of the pilot survival kit. Yeah, actually bit. it was for a little bit. And you can even see GIs holding them up on the helmet band. Yeah, here. Uh, you can do an it's, example here. I might spill over, but here I can... Oh, just, uh, that's gonna spill. Do that afterwards, do that afterwards. Yeah, do that afterwards. Oh, I don't want to there. spill. There, look. Oh, see? Bring it slowly. Actually, look at battle. It's, um... <laughs> So it is 8.4 fluid ounces So is the uh, measurement. Anyways, uh, we've been stalling long enough, you what's guys. The, what's the caffeine contents on this? Uh, what's that? 800 milligrams of caffeine? Okay. Caffeine. Caffeine. This was a, a good field booster for guys uh, under siege, maybe at like yeah. Queso. All right. Queso. Right. Rocco. Even in tet, we got to stay awake. Yeah. You know, bunker, you pop First sip up, yeah. going for Rocco right now. Please make sure you like and subscribe. Yeah. We, we, we got to have some kind of reward for doing this. <laughs> <laughs> what does it taste like? Battery acid? <laughs> no, worse. That's a sweet lemon aroma of like milk. That's more like, you know, lemon milk. Oh my god, I don't really know if I want to do this. Just, just, nope, you got to join it. You got to do it in part of the group. <laughs> May God be with you. Where's my uh, Bible? Oh God! Here, give me my pocket Bible. Where's the pocket uh, pussy? Yeah, is. <laughs> Let me find a prayer first. Oh God! Okay. Here, Philippi, Philippinus. Philippinus. Yeah, he's my favorite in the Bible. Philippinus. All right, Philippinus. Hello. Gentlemen, it has been an honor. Present. Drink. <laughs> oh, you know what it tastes like? What? A Swedish fish. Like, if you suck on it a does. Swedish fish. It does taste like a Swedish fish. Like, like maybe like one that's been left in a bottle of water. Actually, yeah, it tastes like, that's a, it does. <laughs> it does taste like a Swedish fish. Swedish fish and battery. One more swing, boys. Oh, that was a big gulp. This going to make my hangover worse. <laughs> That's very, very... <laughs> we should drink that before the midnight walk. Well, Al Pacino, I'm sure this is very good when it came out, but right now, uh, I'd rather just drink a monster or something. Oops. Not Arab. Okay, uh... Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Uh, enjoy and Steve 1989. Steve MRE 1989. That's right.